weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Hello friends and Merry Bookish Christmas. Welcome to my channel, Wrestling With Books, or you may be coming from my Disney friends. So you may be used to seeing me on Wrestling With Disney, but this is my channel where I talk about everything book related. Now, some of you in the booktube world may not be as used to what I'm about to be doing today as we are in the Disney YouTube world. And it is that us Disney YouTubers love to do what we call box swaps. We love to give each other gifts. So Heather from the Disney Housewife has orchestrated a Christmas book exchange and it just so happens that my box comes from her as well. When I started to get more interested in doing book content and so did Heather, we had started an Instagram chat with other Disney YouTubers who also like doing book content or just likes talking about books and it was through that Instagram chat that Heather ended up putting together this swap. So if you're a booktuber and you think you'd ever like to do an exchange where we buy each other bookish things, you just you just hit me up because that could be, it is a grand old time. I'm not going to say it could be because there's a reason why we do this all the time in the Disneyverse and it's just a fun way of kind of spreading the magic. And what's great about books is, I'm opening the box as I chat with you, is that it does not all have to be new as book lovers. We love thrifted book items or an item that you read and loved and passing it along and whatnot. So that was actually part of the criteria is to get, you know, a new book, to get a th to, or to send a thrifted book, to send a cozy item and to send a bookmark. Buster is sitting next to me, very anxious for me to see what's inside this box. So, woo, we are already seeing some decorations popping out so I've got to be careful okay wow so whew, okay wow look at this oh my gosh so this already is a tote I believe from her library which is so nice I'm actually if I go to my library on Black Friday and take out 15 books I get a free tote so I'm already planning that out oh my god I love this I, the only thing I would love about this more would be if it said, like, let me read on the back. Because uh, there's two times when I don't like when my husband starts showing me things. is when I'm trying to sleep or when I'm trying to read. So I love this. Tom, you see it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let me sleep. And this is just the coziest tote. I love it. But there's probably a card. I should look for it um, before I rummage through things. Because there are little notes on everything. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to do. I don't see a car. Oh, wait, guys. I got to bring the camera over so you can see this. Look at this. It says, bookish. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. Christmas. And we have more peace on earth. Celebrating the season with friends where well, Heather is certainly a good friend of mine and look how everything is packed inside and there are little cards and she even has book paper and look at this guys oh my gosh so it's like a library card and it says a very bookish Christmas oh my gosh author the Disney housewife checked out by Nina and this is a bookish item this is incredible okay so this is what i am talking about when i say that us like disney girls go crazy with box swaps we do we just love to do this sort of thing so i'm so excited that i'm able to post this on my booktube channel to kind of share some of that world so let's just start from the beginning this is the one that i showed you from the start that says a bookish item Oh, Ooh, I see Alistair. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love it. Oh my gosh. Look at this curiouser and curious. Oh, my book 
info. Okay, I get all their email alerts, but I have never bought anything and I've always wanted to. And look, you can put your book inside this or even your Kindle and it's gonna protect it. Cause I know I keep everything I own in my bag. So when I put my book in it too, it like destroys it. So, oh my gosh, you could put them in this beautiful thing and it's all gonna be safe. I love it. I love it. I'm already so happy and Buster's happy with the paper. So I'm just going to keep pulling out items. It looks like we got a book or we can say books. That's what Heather and I say because her husband makes fun of us for always talking about books. <laughs> and this is a book she has read and loved as per the perfect little card. Oh, this could be a nice thumbnail right here. Hold on. Okay, I think we got it. All right. Oh, oh there's, there's two in here. She cheated. Ooh, okay. So first we have In a Dark, Dark Wood by Ruth Ware. Ooh, an instant New York Times bestseller. Looks like, oh, going to be a major motion picture. Did I miss this? Did that already happen? So this looks really, wow, spooky. This is gonna be fun. And we have You Were Always Mine by Nicole Bart. Newly separated and living with her two sons in a small Iowa town, say no more, you know, small town. She receives a phone call that shatters her world, tries to pick up the pieces and make sense of what happened. That the tragic death is just the beginning. She's caught in a web of lies, horrified to learn that all leads back to her adopted seven-year-old son. Wow, that sounds like it's gonna be a really, good intense read and if Heather liked it then I know I'm gonna like it because that's how it's gone so far all right oh this next item is in like a oh they're like looped together blast from the past it says so let's see ooh. yes all right I'm just seeing the top okay which says frost beard studio I have always wanted one of their candles but I've never gotten one for myself I've gotten them for other people <laughs> but not for myself and ooh, coffee and chocolate pastry the theme is reading at the cafe and you know those like coffee shops that have those cafes the bookshops with the cafes and coffee oh yeah Oh yeah, and Heather and I were talking about that before we saw all these Disney candles, Wishes and Magic Candle Co. and everything, we used to see Frostbeard Studio and that it was one of the OGs of can. Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I skipped ahead. This is a book pin. This is a book pin. It looks like she has a little note in it. Oh no, they, they sent, so I know who it's from. Okay, this is from the Pin Bot Shop. And if you're, if you're familiar with my Disney channel, then you know that I collect pins. If you're not, then you're just learning this now. But this says, book it, book it. Fantastic, I should put it on this tote. You know, just saying, just saying. And this came in a really nice little box. I'm gonna keep so I can re-gift in it. Not re-gift the pin, but but the box, if you will. All right, Heather has spoiled me. We have a lot of stuff. This is, as per our little note card, is um, a bookmark. And I, I pause there, because I'm like, I wonder if kids today know about the Dewey Decimal System, you know? Oh, this looks very Dewey Decimal. I love it. Oh my God. Yes. I love this because it's just, it just is that time of life that we're never going to get back. Kids aren't going to understand the beauty of this. And with a mix of the anxiety, how about, okay, in school, when you would check it from books and like check to see if your crush ever had that book and if you did then you'd want to like keep it forever and this is a really nice thick sturdy bookmark i definitely look forward to using that thank you heather and i just love 
the nostalgia feeling of it. Ooh, look, we got a little extra. Some hand lotion. Ooh, by Love Beauty and Planet. So Heather and I like that. We like to be paraben free. It's uh, very important to us both. So, so. All right, we are jam-packed. We got big things, little things to go with a cozy cup of coffee. You know what goes great with a cozy cup of coffee? Me. <laughs> You know, I'm I'm trying to hit all these jokes and not get much feedback. I'm looking at my husband as I say that. <gasps> Guys. First look at this. Okay. Now look at this. Buster. You have a twin coaster. Look at you two! You're twins! You're twins! What do you think of your new coaster? Do you love it? He loves it. He loves it, Heather. That was my I love it face that he does. That was him saying how much he loves it. And you know I love it. So I am all about... So this not only is Buster, as a cup of tea and a pile of books. So these are four of these that she ordered from Society6. They're really like wood and sturdy. I'm doing this to further showcase that. These are fantastic and perfect and I love it. This is so much fun. Ooh, an autobiography of a throwback fave. So could it be the autobiography of Big Bird? La, 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 la. Could it be the uh, throwback fave? The autobiography of Brett the Hitman Hart? The autobiography of Jonathan Taylor Thomas? The autobiography of. Oh. Yes! <laughs> I would have gotten there. I would have gotten there. Yes! The story of Anne M. Martin. This is fantastic. I think any book lover uh, at, you know, my age and Heather's age and, you know, of not the, uh, anyone book lover who knows the Dewey Decimal System, you know, would love to receive this. Oh my gosh. Scholastic biography of Anne M. Martin. Let's, number one, the diaper years. Anne Matthews Martin was born on August 12th. 1955 and it even has like the same like just like font and text of the babysitters club books Heather this was such a good idea oh no we've lost me I'm lost here we go I'm coming in Claire this was a fantastic idea Heather so clever I absolutely love it there's still more items in this you crazy bookish girl so this says extras on it I think it's all been extras, Heather. Oh, yes. All right. All right. We got the crazy cat paw marker. So this is good for when annotating books, when you want to quote things and whatnot. You put the little tab in it. Oh, all you need is love and coffee. I love this coffee design on this notepad. And we got the Golden Girls Planner. Oh, no. It's a notebook even better. It's... A tab notebook like a notebook with dividers which is so helpful because I usually use one notebook but I like to use them for different things like some is for book things some is for work things so it's like Dorothy can be books Blanche can be work you know all these things and it says hearts of gold on the back so if you're watching this let me know who is your favorite golden girl I will let you know that mine is Dorothy so Ooh, this is a wish list book. It's hard to, there's so many. There's so many books on my wish list. Ooh, this looks pretty. Ah, uh, look at this beautiful copy of Peter Pan. Absolutely stunning. I could put it on display in one of these shelves here. I do have some Peter Pan going on behind me. I basically just want any and every copy of Peter Pan and uh, Wizard of Oz. That's another one I like just as much. Maybe Little Women. 
uh, those are my classics where it's like you just take however many copies you can be given. So on the back, we have a quote. And ooh, so it starts off with a really nice map of Neverland. Oh, look at that, come on. Well, oh, so this has, are there illustrations throughout? Yes. So let's find you one, shall we? Oh, oh, oh. I love it. And just look at the spine action. I feel like this is what a sophisticated library needs. So maybe now I have a sophisticated library. Now that I have that. And, oh, is this the card? So here we go. The card. I got to the card. So I'll open the card before the last item. So I'm not a total failure, you know. She says, I hope this brings a smile to your face. And it would really be impossible for it not to. So I just want to, oh, no. Okay, I just want to make sure there's nothing else here. Good, so now let's have at it the final book. And it's a, a Dollar Tree book I couldn't leave behind. So Heather and I love finding Dollar Tree deals. Let's see what it is. Ooh. So funny, I think I got something by this author. So this says the Washington Decree by Juicy Adler Olson. It's probably not juicy as I said that. It's J-U-S-S-I, but uh, to me that's juicy. <laughs> so you can let me know, but I have been getting super into political thrillers. Oh, so like already just scanning it, I'm like, okay, Senator, check, you know, PR stunt, check, 14 year old, you know, like I'm just like browsing through it. I'm like, this will be great. All right. Yeah. I don't want to read the whole thing because that could be, you know, it's, it's pretty like long, lengthy. Um, wow. This is a good Dollar Tree find. Look, if you're getting a New York Times bestselling author book at the Dollar Tree, you shopping right shopping right so let we got a lot of items here but let me just recap the books that we got this great political thriller we have this awesome Anne M. Martin bio which is gonna just really be an awesome way to hit my Goodreads goal we got Peter Pan so we got two new books and then we have these other two soft cover books of You Were Always Mine and In a Dark Dark Wood which are Heather approved so we got ourselves five new books. <laughs> so of course this brought a big smile to my face. I invite you guys to check out all the other channels who are doing this too, because I don't know, maybe I'll get, get some book people hooked on these swaps, you know, <laughs> or it will hopefully just bring a smile to your face. A lot of us have sent books that we already love and approve like Heather did with these two. So you'll see some favorite books out there as well as some wishlist items and bookish accessories. Maybe get some ideas for that upcoming holiday. And you can see, I will let you know who I sent to. It is a channel called Oh Hello Robin. I bet you know her. So you can see what I got her there. This video is a part of my Vlogmas. I'm doing Vlogmas here and on Wrestling with Disney, which means I have a video up on one of those two channels or both every day from now until Christmas Eve. So I hope you'll subscribe and don't forget to let me know who your favorite golden girl is because I'm dying to know. I'm dying to know. I'm hoping Dorothy pulls through for the win. Thanks for being here, guys, and I'll see you soon. Weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Since we've no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow.